This is very early in the season, so you probably won't break any records because these girls are just getting into their stride. But you would think anything uh, probably below a 415 would be pretty solid. Even 420 range today. Just over four minutes. That's a pretty good time there in lane four for Ashley Dow, Laura Paz, Samantha Roberts, and Jana Jansen. Coming down the stretch here, you see your teammates cheering on Hannah Martin too because they know how important it is for those two to finish in the top of the pack. Well, we've got Hannah Martin actually in the third spot. There you go, oh, first place goes to Therese Stevens. So the Penguins again take it, and that's a great time for this time of year. Underneath two minutes for Stevens at 159.19. She also has the team record, 54.83. Guess where she said it? The Horizon League Championships back really? in February. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Three out of the first four events, the team record have come just in February in 2012. Yep. 58 7. There you see, first place goes to Roberts with a time of 108.80. So there you go, underneath 110, and another first place finish for the Penguins. Carly Dean in lane two for the Penguins, pause in four, and Kimberly Kurtz in six. And in first place, in lane four, it's Laura Paz. And she continues to impress here in her junior season. Had a great day on Friday, having another great day today with a time of 213.85. Second place again goes to the Penguins. Kimberly Kurtz, 220.89. So the Penguins take first and second there. Only a freshman, too. Looks pretty strong here. Looks like she'll take first in this heat. Let's see where she clocks in at. There you go, 54. 62. What a time by Johnson. Yeah, Excuse really me, Jansen. Can. You don't get a good push off. Your legs aren't in, in that nice compact. But if you get if you turn too late, they're in too tight of a thing. Mm -hmm. And you really are, are pushing, and it's really hard to get that, that good push off then. So you think it's uh, more like a mental clock for the, this so, kind of Some event? of them it is a mental clock. They, 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 they count their strokes from the flags when they see them go overhead. So they know maybe it's it's four strokes or three strokes or whatever before they have to do it. And it, it's really hope, keeping your pace very good because if, if you don't have a good pacing, then you don't get a good turn off of it. And the Penguins there with Ashley Dow take first with a time of 2.08.06. Really good time for this time of year. So coming down the stretch here. Again, Penguins in lanes four and six. Samantha Roberts looking very strong, and you might uh, expect that out of her. First place goes to Roberts, 226.54. Another nice time. And as a whole, I guess, uh, fall sports, you look at soccer now and volleyball coming to an end. Uh, soccer already ending their season, but... Uh, Two teams there that have really improved. Yeah, definitely they are. Just seeing them over the past couple of years, all the teams really have improved over the past couple of years. And they, they, they're a lot stronger, a lot more competitive now than what they have in the past. The freshman there for the Penguins in first place, Hannah Martin, time of 531.77. Keeps that streak alive. The Penguins have gotten first in every event here today as we move to event number 13 now. Great job by Megan Siempa in lane six. Comes in with a time of 449.42. Takes first place again for the Penguins. And then Samantha Roberts checks in in second. So the Penguins 
sweep first and second once again. 